Yeah, I kind of wanted to show you the system I worked out. All the camper pop-up campers have your stock support legs that go down, which seems to be okay to me, especially if you have one person, you know, up to 200, 250 pounds sleeping on here. Those support systems would probably work pretty good. If you do a lot of camping as a couple and you like to sleep together on the same bed, I think whenever you start adding two people on top of this bed system, on top of these rails right here, I think you're going to overload it. Now, especially if there's any kind of movement going on. And on this one right here, I'll show you what I did. That is just too much weight for these support legs right here. So what I did was I I come up with one system on the back. I took a two by four, left and right, left and right. I always mark everything like that. It makes it real clear to me. And there is a hole right here on my hitch. Take this boat through here like this. And then this piece comes over. It will go on that boat. Just like that right there. If you wanted to really do it right, you'd go ahead and tighten all this down with a wrench just to make sure, especially if you're going to camp for a week or so. So that goes on there like that. Then you have your top piece, which is this right here. And I've also got it marked right and left. And it is going to go right underneath this bed system like this. And I've got my leg marked right. And it will go in here. Like that. And this one comes over here. And it goes on there. And fits on there just like that right there. So you can see how it's going to work. Once this is tightened down, it won't move as much. I have a couple little blocks here to keep these pieces from going left and right. But I notice I'm missing a block and I did find it in one of my drawers in there. So what I need to do is put longer screws in these blocks so they don't come back off. Now when I set this up, I don't release the stock legs that are going down. I still utilize them, but this is just an added support system. So everything is a little bit more stable. On the pop-up camper group not long ago, a lady wrote in. If it was a birthday party or a party for the kids, Four or five girls were sitting on the bed and apparently were just sitting there calmly watching TV. And all of a sudden the whole bed system broke. It came down, it ripped her canvas, it bent up all the bed frame and everything like that. For whatever reason, the bed system gave way and I don't want that to happen. Even so if I am sleeping by myself on this side, everybody tends to roll around at night, left, right, whatever. I just want to make sure that doesn't happen. I end up trashing the Coleman 1985. Sunday. Now here's the system that I worked out for the other side, the other bed system. And this one works pretty good. And I have this on several of my videos that I have on the 19... Actually, my videos that I have may actually say 1987 Coleman Sun Valley. But it turned out to be license plate not long ago. It turned out to be this is a 1985 Coleman. The man I bought it from told me it was a 1987. Turns out to be a 1985. Sounds okay to me. On this system right here, it's pretty nice. It all stays together. It fits underneath here. These legs will swivel out back and forth to adjust for the height. And then you have this nice strap. Once it's all said and done, you put this strap on here, you crank it down, and it, it's pretty, pretty sturdy system. I do have my braces that are going down on both sides and that's really important to keep those up as well as having this extra support right here. I'm not exactly sure why I didn't do the same thing on the other side. I just think that I noticed that the, the tongue of the trailer stuck out and it was a perfect place to brace from and that way there I don't have to worry about the height up and down. 
A lot of times, if you if I go camping and it's a slope, this bed can end up being pretty dang high up in the air. That's why I always have blocks with me and stuff that make these poles longer. And you can't make these poles too long if, you, if, if the opposite and this bed, the slope's going the other way and this bed is real low to the ground, then these won't work because they'll be too long. Plus, this is about the right height to store inside when I'm trying. LAF Space Film Fest, capital LAF Space Film Fest. Hammer down that subscribe button. Helps me to put out videos like this. I appreciate you coming to the channel.